inductor. Inductor is such as electric component which is wire but consists number of turns is called coils or winding its ability of induction when current passes through coils then magnetic field will produce this magnetic field store energy. Fraday's law. First law. When conductor cuts magnetic field then EMF electromotive force will induce in this conductor the amount EMF. Induced voltage is directly proportional to the rate of change of the magnetic field with respect to the coil. Second law. The EMF induced in an electric circuit is proportional to the time rate of change of the flux of magnetic induction linked with the circuit. The magnitude of the induced EMF is directly proportional to the change of current. Lens S law. 1. When an EMF is induced in a circuit, the current step up always opposes the motion, or change in current, which produces it too. According to his law an EMF will cause a current to flow in a close circuit in such a direction that its magnetic effect will oppose the change that produces it. 3. When the current through a coil changes an induced voltage is created as a result of the changing magnetic field. The direction of the induced voltage is such that it always opposes the changing current for. An induced effect is always such as to oppose the that produced it. Self-induction. 1. The property of a circuit by virtue of which an EMF is induced in the circuit whenever the current is changed. Or 2. The property of the coil due to which it opposes any increase or decrease of current or flux through it, is known as self-induction. Or 3. Self-induction is the property of an electrical circuit that opposes any change in current in that circuit. The letter symbol for induction is L. Mutual induction. 1. The ability of one coil or circuit to produce an EMF in a nearby coil by induction when the current in the first coil changes is called mutual induction. Or 2. Mutual induction is that induction which exists between magnetically coupled coils of the same or different dimensions. Basic transformer. Transformer is a static device where the voltage is applied, called primary winding cores and where is obtained change of a voltage or current level. Called secondary windings cores transformer transfers electrical power without changing of frequency while both windings primary and secondary isolates with a base of electrical connection but couples with magnetically fluxes each. Other transformer is working in the law of electromagnetic induction such as Fraday's law and also Lenz's law. Step up. Transformer output voltage level higher as compares to input voltage level, less, is called step up. Step down. Transformer output voltage level less as compares to input voltage level higher is called step down. Obtained by transformer. One output voltage can be varied increase or decrease. Two output current can be varied increase or decrease. Three output power remains same. Relationship. 1 when voltage increases of transformer then current will decrease or vice versa. 2 frequency will remain same 3 transfer power is per requirement. Formula. Number of turn. N number of primary turn. NP number of secondary turn. N's turn ratio formula. Formula relationship between primary. Secondary currents and primary voltage and secondary voltage by the turns ratio Q. A transformer primary winding 100 turns, and the secondary has 400 turns. What is the turn ratio? Solution. N's equals 400 no equals 100 then turn ratio equals N's NP equals equals 400 slash 100 equals 4 N's. Q2A transformer has a 200 turn primary winding and 600 turn secondary winding. What is the voltage across the secondary? Solution. NP equals 200 ends equals 600 then turn ratio equals ends NP equals equals 600 slash 200 equals 3 ends. Now VZ equals 3 VP equals 120 equals 3 X 120 equals 360 VQ 3 The transformers have loaded secondaries if the primary current is 100 ma in each cases, 
How much is the load current? Solution is equals NPNs I equals 0 0.1 100 ma equals 10 ma b is equals NPNs I equals 2 100 ma equals 200 ma q for a single phase transformer has 525 primary turns and 70 secondary turns if the primary is connected to a 3300 volt supply find the secondary potential difference neglecting losses what is the primary current when the secondary current is 250 amp solution we know that nzn1 equals v2 slash v1 70 slash 525 equals v2 or equals 70 x 3300 slash 525 equals 440 volts ants neglecting losses v2 slash v1 equals i1 slash i2 or v1 v1 equals v2 i2 3300 i1 equals 440 x 250 i equals 440 x 250 slash 3300 equals 33.3 amp ands q5 an auto transformer has an output of 2a at 8v if the secondary turns are 20 and the primary voltage is 240 v Calculate the number of turns in the primary winding and the current in the primary neglecting losses. Solution. Primary voltage secondary voltage equals primary turns secondary turns or VPVs equals NPNs primary turns equals NZ X VPVs equals 20 by 240 slash 8 equals 600 we know that. IPAS equals NZ NP IP equals is X NZ NP equals 8 X 20 slash 600 equals 0 0.267 A.